So a, I, I saw this really interesting study about pre-industrial societies, societies that um, don't have indoor heating or mm -hmm. electric um, lighting. And the, they, the, what they looked at, they looked at like how, how these uh, societies sleep. They usually sleep, uh, you would think that they sleep when the sun goes down, right? Uh, but it, it actually is not the, the case. They're, the um, they, they usually go to sleep th three hours after the sun goes down, and it's usually mm -hmm. when the temperature starts dropping. Mm -hmm. So temperature is a bigger kind of uh, cue for your internal biology to, to, to uh, your your temperature drops tells your internal biology that you need to go to sleep, mm -hmm. and you actually you need to drop your body temperature in mm -hmm. order to um, go to sleep and get enough deep sleep and REM sleep. So um, that was a, that was an interesting point, and once we started kind of coaching people to um, you know think of their internal uh, or like indoor heating mm -hmm. in that way, like cooling off at night and uh, in, in in their sleep environment. Mm -hmm that like has a huge impact on on sleep uh, yeah. markers interesting maybe that's also the same reason why um eating earlier like three to four hours before and when yeah. your food is already digested your sleep like your core body temperature will decrease exactly. um, having things like uh, glycine which is an amino acid which also reduces the body temperature helps you fall sleep faster your sleep latency is higher 100 and um yeah sleeping in a cooler room every time you and it happens to me every time I travel, right? I'm one of those people that I say like, hey, listen, even if I'm going to a cold place, like make sure there's no heater because at least in the night, there are two things that I want to make sure of. One is that there's not a lot of light that's coming into the room. And, you know, it, here in UAE, we're kind of lucky because most of the places there are these big curtains that are completely blackout. But like Europe and so many other places, like, you know, hotels don't have that. So that's one of my criteria I'm looking for a complete blackout curtain. And there have been points where you know I've taken garbage bags and stuck them on the the windows yeah. because you know light is such a big light and temperature both of them are such big cues and then food as well. Yeah, um, 100%. Also, interestingly, it's when your core body temperature decreases and your you know melatonin is also increasing at the same time, so you fall asleep, and as you're as you're about to wake.